Okay, here are my pickups for today, Saturday. Actually, I went to a townwide today. Uh, it was crazy. There were actually six townwides going on uh, today where I live. And uh, I went to the one where they had never had a townwide before. And uh, I think it was Fairlawn. Uh, yeah, Fairlawn. And they had 300 sales. Obviously, I could not go to 300 sales. I believe I went to about 75. And uh, I spent $333 on everything you see here. And I'm actually pretty happy today. Because even though it doesn't look like a lot, I got some pretty good deals, including some gold. I'm going to break this up into three videos. I just got too much to, to go through. Uh, I'm going to do collectibles and DVDs in the first video. For I got uh, CDs, as you can see. Um, generally, I paid a buck a piece for these. I can sell these anywhere from $2 to $5 or 3 for 5 or something like that. Not a lot of profit, but I, p I picked and choose, and I got some good ones. So I got like a John Lennon acoustic. Maybe I can ask 5 or, or 4 or something for those. Um, I'm just going to go through the DVDs for my friend quick, The Wrestler. Batman Begins, uh, The Rescuers Down Under, uh, Nick and Dora, The Catch the Stars, <clears throat> The Great Dinosaur Rescue, The Da Vinci Code, The Original Carrie, I want to see that since the new one's coming out, A Susan Boyle, The Making of a Dream, Men in Black 3, um, but this, maybe I can use this sometimes, uh, it says three home PC licenses, so maybe it was only used once, maybe twice, if I can use it, I can use it great, I'll give it to a friend, I already have, um, the software, but never know. Uh, it was only $2 anyway. Super bad. Uh, Dead Silence. You can't sell that software on eBay anymore anyway. Cloverfield. Uh, Pokemon, the first movie. I'm probably going to keep that for the kid. Flushed Away. Kirby, Fright to the Finish. I bought that kind of for my kid to watch. Troy. Oops. What's this? This I knocked the cap off of this. Let me just put this back on quick. Alright. Alright. Uh, Shrek the Third. Finding Neverland. 51st Date. Fame, Narnia, Prince Caspian, Burn After Reading, The Haunted Airman. I bought this because uh, Robert Pattinson's in it. I don't know how many movies he's been in besides uh, Twilight. Uh, Beverly Hills Chihuahua 2, Blue, a very good movie. Uh, Despicable Me, I like to buy kids' movies. Uh, Shrek Forever After. All right, let me go through the collectibles. Um, this is made in India. It's old, uh, not really valuable, not eBayable, anything like that, but it was only $2.00. If I sell it eight, ten, twelve dollars, that's fine. It's a nice, colorful piece. Um, I think I'll just flea market it. Uh, here's a nice Murano vase. I paid four for this, and you can tell it has some age for sure, uh, just by looking at the bottom and the design. Um, I don't know what you call this design. Uh, it's just like a cloud kind. It's got silver flecks in it, Micah. Uh, four dollars. I can probably get. 30 or so at the flea markets. You know, I don't go to really great flea markets, but I think I'll get at least 30 um, on eBay. If I could attribute it to someone, I'd get a lot more, but I doubt that'll happen. But some perfumes today. Uh, this is Avon Vanilla Soft Musk. I, you know, this, these were cheap. I, I don't remember what I paid for these, but it might have been a few dollars. Um, I, don't, I think I've had this. I think I could sell it. Uh, I've been buying anything Estee Lauder. This is Super Cologne. I don't remember what I paid for this, too. I might have paid 5 uh, Jean 2, I don't know why I bought that. This must have been cheap. Um, this big lager filled eau de toilet. I think I've had these. Uh, I might have paid five. Uh, this might be worth 20 or so. Um, this is Aroma Absolute Jean Arthes Paris. It might be a good name. Um, let's see. This was 15 and this was 15. But this is Swarovski. This one's full. The 15, I got it for 10 because I bought it with this one, which was also priced 15. It was the end of the day. And this one is uh, Estee Lauder Century Chanel. I like anything Estee Lauder seems to sell. Uh, this is Joy by Jean Pateau. I paid maybe 50 cents for this, and I think I can sell that. I'm not really sure, but I think it's a available. And then this one just looks old. Uh, Joy de Vive. Uh, it's perfume, half ounce. Might be worth 10 to 20 on eBay. Not really sure on that. Uh, I got this. This was really cheap. I believe it was like $2, and it's basically a big Fenton cake plate. I'll just flip it at the flea market for between 10 and 15 On eBay, it'd probably worth 30 or so. Um, for $5. You got this. This is actually, it's, it's only like 4 megapixels, but it has a 48 times zoom lens on it. And uh, you know what? For 5 bucks, it's a screwing around camera. I don't care what happens to it. If it gets blown up, burnt, dropped in water... Uh, I don't care. Five bucks. It'll do the job. I can do uh, low-res internet pictures, um, knock around video, and, and like I said, it's got a 48 times zoom. That's like amazing um, to, to have on a camera. Um, but these, I don't know if you people have seen these before. 
um, or what they do, but they're actually called eye cups. People used to use them to clean their eyeballs. Uh, they'd fill them with boric acid and, uh, and water and just tilt them up into their eye and clean them out. These are probably worth between uh, five or so a piece. Um, they might be available. You know, I used to see them all the time. Now I never see them. Um, two Coco Joe, probably like bookends, but they're very light. Um, as you can see, they're tiki figures. Uh, these were like a dollar for the two or maybe two dollars for a boat. I can sell these at a flea market. They might be uh, worth about 15 or so on eBay. I would never put them on eBay. They'll sell them at a flea market between 5 and 10. Um, let's see. Jade Act Bull. Uh, this one is a fire... Fire King. Jade Act Bull. Five, uh, pitcher. Uh, or pouring bowl. Uh, five bucks. You know, even at a flea market, I should get between 50 and 30, uh, 15 and $30. Not really sure how popular Jade Act is right now. Maybe it's, it's worth a decent amount on eBay. I'll have to look it up. It'd have to be worth, like, between 40 and 50 for me to bother listing, not to switch shipping. Um, got these old cast iron bookends. I actually paid eight because I bought them with something else. And, uh, they're wheat. I, you know, I, they're not, I can't attribute it to anybody. I'll try and figure out who made them. But I'll probably sell them for like 15 to 20 at a flea market. Uh, this is a old, uh, I think it's bronze cannon. I didn't see any maker's mark on it. I've had these before. You'd think they would be worth more, but not unless you can actually fire them. And this one wasn't made to be fired. It's just a decorative item. It doesn't even sit right when you put it there. So I'll probably sell it like 20 to 35 or something like that. And I only paid, I think, a quarter for it. I bought it with other stuff. Um, we got two Pyrex bowls. These are from the 70s with lids, uh, glass lids. I paid three for the two. I will sell these maybe 15 to 20 for the two. Flip them at the flea market. Uh, continuing on with collectibles. Let's see. Uh, I got this. This is probably from Thailand. That's what the people said. I don't know. It has an Asian look to it. These are lizards. It has a wood carved design with a lizard and uh, some kind of face, a mask or something. It's pretty neat. Uh, it looks like bronze, and it looks like it's not really old, but it was made to look old. Uh, I think I paid I paid 12 for these in the bookend, so I, probably, I guess I paid 4 for it. Uh, let's see. I got some clothes and stuff. That's nonsense. Um, but whatever. It's all part of the 333 I spent today. This is probably the, the most valuable thing I got today in terms of collectibles, except for maybe one of the perfumes. Um, you know, this is probably... They, uh, I think they call this Champlev, and it's probably Japanese, and I think it's like a bronze, and they have like a... It's like a cloisonne, a type of cloisonne. Uh, this one has uh, birds in the figures, and it has dragon handles. It's a lamp. I paid 20. Uh, gonna toss away the shade. It has uh, the top on it. Uh, you know, if I, in an antique store, this is probably like at least several hundred. I don't really know what I'm gonna get at a flea market. I'll probably get between 50 and 100, but I have to check. I'll check. If it's on eBay, if it's like 300 or 250, I might eBay it. Um, anyway, that covers the collectibles I got today. I have a whole bunch of toys and jewelry um, to go through that I got. Video games, too. And uh, I did really well today, uh, but I'll cover those in the next two videos.